Police are investigating a mysterious death outside an Ogden apartment complex. New special Sandra Adams live in the neighborhood for us tonight near 22nd and Jefferson with the latest on this one. Andrew? Well, Mike, police haven't told us much yet, but they were here investigating until well after dark. Uh, the body was removed within the last hour. The mobile command center pulled away within the last half hour. This all centered around these uh, apartments, and we're going to push in and give you a slightly closer look. You see those two uh, rooms where the lights were on. Investigators were looking in that area, as well as the uh, fire escape, trying to get to the bottom of things. Uh, this is the Iron J apartments. Investigators are trying to figure out exactly what happened, as were neighbors tonight. Stuff happens around here kind of often. In a neighborhood that is no stranger to police activity. It's not the first time that something's happened back there. There have been few scenes stranger than this one. We just assumed that it was pretty much the same situation where somebody was like running from the police and we realized it was more than that. Brittany Donovan says officers showed up this afternoon. And they just asked if anybody noticed anything around midnight last night. It was apparently after a grim discovery was made on the grounds next to this apartment building. And then we realized that CSI was there and we were like, oh yeah. Ogden police confirmed that someone died and they are treating the matter as an unattended death. Investigators tell KSL it was too early to say what it was from an accident to a homicide. I've never seen anybody standing out there. Though officers appear to be taking a close look at the area surrounding the third floor window and fire escape, neighbors express skepticism that whatever happened here was that simple. Looking at everything that I saw, it doesn't look just like somebody fell out of the window. They expect the answers to be far stranger. It's great. It's really crazy. Well, again, police trying to figure this one out. They spent quite a bit of time here this afternoon and evening trying to get to the bottom of it. As soon as we get developments, we'll bring them to you right here on KSL 5. But for now, back to the studio. Yeah.